this is my job. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I'm Kelsey. I'm single and we thought it would be funny for me to try the 100 baby challenge It's a challenge in the Sims where you make a matriarch and that matriarch is supposed to have 100 children There are a lot of rules to this challenge. So if you're interested in those rules There will be a link below you might have noticed from my last I did a weird hair flip But you might have noticed from the last video that I'm wearing this awesome new t-shirt to remind both you and me who I am I know we all forget sometimes or some of you call me Chelsea on purpose Here's a little reminder for you and if you need your own reminder you can match me now you can be not Chelsea too and we can all be not Chelsea together and honestly if your name's Chelsea I think this is much funnier of a shirt could you imagine meeting someone for the first time and wearing this shirt and they'd be like hi I'm Chelsea they would not know what to trust it'd be great <laughs> all right lots of links lots of talking let's talking more babies so we're back in the peach Schmay household last we left Chelsea she was flirting it up she was ready to close the deal and then the game blocked us from our dreams I also apparently just recently fed my vegan children bacon. Did someone pull out the violin? They did. Happy Sunday, family. Essentially, what we need to do is make sure we really focus on Jamie and Brielle. Now, Jamie just became a teen, but he is already a skill level three, and his homework is complete, and he did extra credit. So we've done everything we can. Brielle, her homework is complete. I think she's also done extra credit as well. And she's, her skill level's to three, and she's an excellent B student, so I think it's only a matter of like one day at school before we can age her out of the house. We can also just really focus on Charlie and what Charlie needs. I think Charlie can also take himself to the toilet now. He can! Our perfect baby angel Charlie, son of Craig. Oh, he has a little C name like his dad. Oh no! Hazel's sad. Also, why is Hazel in this room? Okay, we need to move Hazel. I think we're gonna move Hazel into mom's room because I don't want Hazel in the room with the toddler and there's not enough room to move the toddler bed. So this is what we're doing right now. Mom's gonna feed baby Hazel. I don't know if we need this anymore, to be quite honest. It would be cool to get Jamie on guitar, but we already started a skill for Jamie. He's a gaming boy. He's a music lover, but maybe maybe that's like one of those things where like you're, you love it, but like you don't challenge yourself to become a master at it until later in life. And that's what I'm gonna say the story is instead of it being I chose a course and I forgot and now I'm lazy. All right, we got a new birth certificate too to add to Kelsey, Chelsea's wall of victory. Look at that. We're always gonna be one behind though because I messed it up one time. That's okay. I know we could cheat and, and get it, but I think it's kind of quirky that Chelsea lost one person's birth certificate. Like I find that very entertaining. So we got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, technically eight kids. I think it was actually Brielle's birth certificate that was lost. Why don't you socialize with, that is not, Never mind. I thought that was her brother, but it's not her brother. It is the future dad. <laughs> Oops. What's happening? What's wrong? There it is, the toilet. We have a lot of money, so we can't just replace it. What kind of people are we gonna be now? I think we're gonna be the people that repair. Wait, there's, we have plants here? Who planted stuff without telling me? Brielle, was that you? These plants don't need water. Apparently she did something over here. <laughs> Renee just walked in on Jamie taking a photo of himself while pooping. He took a selfie like, and Renee was like, oh my God, my brother's horrible. Oh my God, I love it. This is so funny. Dang it, the shower. Reliability three. I think we're gonna sell that shower and get a better one because we in the money right now. All right, hopefully that'll be more reliable and we'll have less me messes ups. Messes ups. She's doing great. We I mean, need to use the restroom and have a sleep before our school. I want her to be perfect for school tomorrow. Just absolutely like the best mood she's ever been in in her whole life, which I mean right now, She's looking like it. Oh no! She's like, Miles, get out. Stop being cleanly, boy. And Jamie is embarrassed. Probably because he's walked in on, yes, he was taking a photo of himself on the toilet. I it was so funny. We'll have everybody get to sleep. Wow, everyone's asleep. As Chelsea writes late into the night, her new life's work, the screenplay. There's not much for our kids to do until school, which is, I guess, a good problem to have. Chelsea finished her first thing here. Let's uh, sell it to the publisher. Oh, and now she's reading a cooking book? Are you really? Wow, she's gonna be our next chef child. Chelsea's up to stuff. 
And then, is there food? Oh yeah, there is, but it's bacon and eggs and we got two children that are vegetarians. I'm a bad mom. Why is she sad? From meeting her new sibling she didn't want, I died. That cracks me up. Now it's just our Brielle. We're like spending our final moments with our teen Brielle. I would say the third hottest in Peach Ishmay child. First we got obviously Olive, and then we got Jamie, and then we probably Brielle. Now, I, I'm sure, you know, most mothers wouldn't rank their children by hotness, but I ain't your normal mom. Oh no, he's awake and he's hungry. I'm sorry, your sister's making you food. Just hold on, my little bean. What else do you need? Nothing else. Oh no, you're just crying to your older brother. He's sleeping, don't wake him up. No, 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 sleep, it's fine, everything's fine. Oh, was that baby about to eat the, I don't want you to eat the cake. Don't eat cake for food. I want you to eat the, why is he glitching? What is happening? No children of mine are eating the cake. My poor little bean. I can't wait for him to age up because I can't wait to see what Charlie looks like. I hope you look like your dad. I hope you take after your dad, Charlie. Toddler lesson. Oh no, need to care for him. I'm sorry, what do you mean? You're doing fine. Why is she so uncomfortable? Oh, cause there's a dirty object. What needs, what, where? Where's, oh, cause she cleaned it. Okay. What a drama queen. I thought Olive was the one that was squeamish. What you, what's your problem? All right, so he's gonna do that and then he's gonna give a bubble bath to Charlie. Little brother time, that's so cute. Oh, all right. We're... They're both giggling and hanging out. Just two bros having a time, having a little chin wag. Oh, you, your bladder needs to go. Why don't you just go potty then, my Charlie? Yeah. Good boy. Yes, oh, baby's crying. Baby's crying, mom, 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 feed your baby. Hazel needs you, mom. Mom, mom, Hazel needs you. Good job, Charlie, you're so good. Why is she so uncomfortable? Stop being uncomfortable, please. Hygiene, okay, take a shower. Who's crying? Baby's crying again? Okay, now she's fine, good, okay, good. Okay, mom, gotta, gotta take care of your baby. What's wrong, baby? What do you need from me? Oh, I wanna be a ninja when I grow up. Amazing. What do I need to do to start getting ready for uh, being a ninja when I'm a grown up? Start practicing your hiding, get a ninja outfit, or find a ninja to train you. I'll say, find a ninja to train you. Why is the baby still crying? Wow, Hazel might be the biggest crybaby child we've had so far. Okay, Brielle is off to school. Brielle, Brielle, we missed her, we missed her. She already disappeared. We didn't get our final moments with our teens. There's the rest of them, little line of humans. We always make them study hard, even though it makes them less happy later. I don't care. And now we only have two kids to hang out with. Aww. How cute. Oh, Revobi. It's so cute. We love him. And look at the creepy gnome in the backyard. Memories. Sore back from a cheap bed. What do you mean sore back from a cheap bed? That's not a cheap bed. Do we need to upgrade her bed? I guess we'll upgrade her bed. All right. I love having money. That one's cute. All right, that's our new bed. Wow, he's really killing it on a lot of fronts here. He's like really close with Potty too, which is crazy. He's the perfect son, honestly. He did so well. Oh, someone's calling Chelsea. Oh, phone to pick. Brielle was discovered playing games on her phone. Senior at us. We'll raise her responsibility. Confiscate the phone. Yeah, don't, don't be on your phone at school, kids. Another phone call. Jamie was caught using his phone to look up answers. He was gonna cheat, Jamie! No! Demon child. Figure out the quiz should do it. Yeah, yeah. He's learning response. Oh my God, so many phone calls. What is love? We found an unset love letter from Alexis to her teacher in her desk today. Nothing racy, but we thought you should know. Oh, uh, she's in big trouble. Cute, but inappropriate, we'll talk. Don't punish love. I say cute, but inappropriate, we'll talk. That I think is the real answer, I would say. No, we're not gonna hang out with you, Sergio. You're, you, we don't need to hang out with you anymore. We've had our time and now it is over. <laughs> Woo, okay, today's mail has been delivered. Not woo, we have bills and our baby's crying. Ask what's wrong. Aw. It's okay, what do you need, baby? You poor thing, Hazel. Wow, this baby needs a lot of attention, honestly. Not our Jamie, or I mean our Charlie. I have too many children now. And a lot of them are starting to have similar names. All right, there we go, buddy. Yeah, you get it. He's sleepy a little bit and a little sad. He doesn't want Hazel in the house. It's okay, buddy. Chelsea, do you really need to be in that outfit? I feel like you should change your outfit here. Ooh, maybe athletic wear. Maybe she should like go work out. Let's go for a jog. Go work out, Chelsea. I always feel a lot better after I work out. Oh, the baby's crying because it's smelly. All right, Chelsea's going, on. ooh, maybe on Chelsea's run she'll meet like a new suitor. Let's see. Nope. 
I've never met anyone on my runs either, to be quite honest. So uh, this is clearly not how you pick up men. All right, back to uh, Charlie. He's a little hungry. He could do with some food. I think it might be time to run home, Chelsea. Run home. Gotta take care of your baby. Your baby's needs. Oh, or you just run past your home. You gonna run home now? There you go. Okay, now she's home. She feels strong. She feels good. That's awesome. She had a good workout. Meanwhile, our perfect baby angel here has eaten some food and is now back uh, working on his skills. He's getting really close to a level three on his second level three skill. Oh, okay, Brielle swiped an object while she was at school. She returned home with a school project. Her grades are up! She's got an A. Oh my gosh. And Jamie returned home with the school project and has a B. So he did go up a grade, which is great. Oh, Miles. Or, I mean, uh, Charlie's reached level three on thinking. And then Alexis, what age are you, my friend? Alexis is... An A student, so we can age up Alexis and we can age up Brielle. Jamie's already a B student, which is an excellent B student at that. So we're actually not that far off from my goal of moving both of the teens out. Actually, I'm really sad about that though because I think Jamie's really fun to be around. But um, okay, so we don't need to do much with her. Miles needs to eat and then after he eats, he'll do his homework. And then we're back at Charlie who's crushing it. All right, and break, let's go. Move your butt, Chelsea. Your kid needs to de-stress on his games. Play Sims, get happy. It's almost Hazel's birthday, yeah, buddy. Aw, Jamie's hanging out with little Charlie on his bed. I remember when Jamie was just a boy, and now he's practically a man. And that's weird. We'll have to just remember that Jamie is Jamie, you know what I'm saying? Like, we can't accidentally run into him out in the world <laughs> while we're looking for dad. That would be crazy and horrifying. It's not Game of Thrones. I don't even think Game of Thrones would touch that. <laughs> She's doing her homework. Why are you doing your homework? We didn't even ask you to do your homework and you're gonna age up soon. Actually, we could age her up now. Mom's pretty good, have, have her bake a cake. Wait, but we should just do one big birthday party for everybody. Once everyone's good, we, do, we shouldn't have another birthday party when everyone's mad. Jamie's homework's complete. Work it, Jamie. Oh, baby's up, baby's up. Brielle's up, cause she's a champion. Change that dirty diaper, Brielle. Hazel's almost done with being a baby. Carly is a sleepy boy, but he's actually ready to build some more skills. Potty is the closest, so we'll maybe have him potty and then we'll have him try the movement skill. All right, go for it. Wake up at 9.30, my son, to get your skills in order. An idea is forming in my brain. I'm thinking we're gonna send them the kids to school. When they get back, we're gonna throw the birthday party. And the birthday party will be for all three kids, but we'll also invite over her next suitor. So then during the birthday party, the two new babies will be made. We'll have time for twins. We'll age everybody up. It's gonna be amazing. <gasps> maybe, maybe it'll be a four children aged up at the birthday party if we can get Charlie there on time. Am I good at this now? Who knew after, what is this, the eighth episode? After like eight episodes. <laughs> okay. <laughs> That's apparently me being very proud of myself. All right, so yeah, we gotta get Charlie on the job here just to get him hyped for the birthday party. Aw, she wants, he wants to go to a party with Olive, but you gotta stay in and be a good boy and do your homework so that you can go live with your sister tomorrow. Someone have an accident? What happened? <gasps> Our computer broke? Our really expensive new computer? Jeez. All right, we're gonna have Chelsea repair it. We'll have her handle this baby. And then meanwhile, you are gonna stop doing that and you're gonna clean up. I'm gonna use all the children to do the jobs. And break. I'm gonna put this in the trash can. The magical money making trash can that doesn't make any sense. Texting on the toilet. When did I give you a cell phone? Okay. You're sad about that potty? Don't be sad about the potty situation. You did your best. We're proud of you. Come on, come on. I don't want to make him mad, but I also want his bar to age up. Oh, we're playing with fire here with Jamie. Ooh, Chelsea finished her book before Jamie even, or, oh my gosh, Charlie, for Charlie. Come on, Charlie, come on, Charlie. You got this. You're almost there, and then you can eat and go to bed. I know you're mad. Yes, all right, eat, go to bed. We're so close. So all Charlie needs is potty and imagination. Are you proud of yourself, little bean? Mom's like just staring at her kid for no reason. Cute, but now she's gonna go to bed. Good night, my sweet child. You, you feed yourself and take care of your own needs while I'm gonna go to bed. Now back to our perfect favorite child. I mean, all of my children are perfect and my favorite, but mostly this one because he's the son of Craig. Charlie, son of Craig. <gasps> 
Craig is asking me out on a date. He still loves her. I'm sorry, Craig. It's also 3 a.m. What a weirdo. I really think that when this is all said and done and Chelsea's an elder, she and Craig are gonna get married. I love you, my son. Look at his dumb little face. I can't wait for the birthday party tomorrow. It's gonna be a fiasco. I can't wait. Don't you dare put that away, mister. Put it on the ground. Mama wants that cash money. I can't wait for my kids to go to school today. Never have I been so excited. Do you think it's gonna be the day? Do you think he's gonna make it? Oh my gosh. Oh my God, they're all going to school. This is not a drill. Oh my God, we miss Jamie. Bye Jamie, study hard. Become an A student. Is Chelsea cooking something for fun? She's making a faux BLT. I don't know why, but there we are. Oh no, she's late for school because she's on the computer. No girl. I mean, I know you. at this point school is kind of moot, but like also not. Oh, the baby's crying. What's wrong, baby? What do you need? You need conversation. And then we're gonna repair that. You're still crying? What's wrong now? This baby's super needy. Charlie crushing everything. Crush it, Charlie, so that I can age you up at the same day as all your other siblings. Olive is calling? Yeah, yeah, you can chat with Olive on the phone. Yes, Olive! We can't go to the festival with you. We have so much going on, but w you'll be at the birthday party later anyway. Did you do it? You did it. You're so close though to level three on potty. I kind of like when she goes jogging. I think it's really cute. What did you, why did you change that to go jogging? I just wanted her to have like a nice jog because she felt good after it. And look what we're, we are now. Okay, now she's going. Yes, queen. We love a fit queen. I actually have an outfit that kind of looks like that too. Oh, change that dirty diaper. Kids should be coming at home in a couple hours, but I think we'll make it there. I think we'll get him to make it. Come on, Charlie. It will be insane if we age up four children at once. Insane. <gasps> okay, grades are up. Renee's got to be perfect. Jamie's an A student. Yay! Oh, so good. Miles is a B student. Brielle stole again. Brielle still has an A, and Alexis still has an A. Uh, mate, also, wait. Is she going to Land Grab Academy? Do you mean that the Land Grab family is in charge of their schooling? Nancy Land Grab, even when you become an elder, we can't escape you. Oh my God, that's insane. So let's just let all these children kind of like fix their needs right now. He's sad. Don't be sad. We're having a birthday party very soon. Charlie, oh, Charlie's almost there. Come on, Charlie. Yeah, Charlie. All right, this is his final potty and then we can have the birthday party that is four children aging up and then she's gonna hook up with some it's all gonna happen. It's all gonna happen. I'm so, I've never been so excited. This potty means so much more than other potties to me. It's Hazel's birthday. <gasps> Are we seriously gonna age up? And Miles just hit potty level three. We are gonna age up five children in one moment. I'm so stoked. Oh my God, the only people that are aging up are the twins. This is insane. Let's have her wake up, it's seven o'clock. It's a little late for a kid's birthday party, but we don't really care. All right, so we're gonna have a birthday party. Now, birthday sim, one is required, but we got Jamie, we got Brielle, we got Alexis, we got Charlie, all the guests. We got Renee and Miles, Chelsea, Santa Claus is coming. We got Dominic, father of Brielle, we got Jay, father of Jamie, Olive's obviously coming, and then our next bae, Karin's coming. And Craig's gonna be there too because we love him. All right, select a place. Obviously, we're going to be at the baby factory. Okay, oh, oh, whoa, everything got ahead of me. We gotta get her into a fun outfit. Let's have her in, ooh, let's have her in like a formal wear because I don't know why. Let's do a really fun cake. Let's do the hamburger cake for all the kids. And then let's see who's who's arriving. <gasps> we, it's Olive and she just gave her birthday sister a hug. Oh my God, I'm dying. Oh my God, he's in coat and tails. Santa's here. Baby's crying, you know what that means. I think, I think, can she age up the baby? Let's have the baby age up. Craig's here. Oh my God, our new bae is here. Karen, Karen, we don't know. I'm so excited. Here we go. Oh wait, we didn't invite the littler kids' as dads. Pick a number between one and eight. The answer is three. Three, so this baby's gonna be clingy. No one's surprised. Gosh, Hazel. Hazel's a clingy baby. Oh my God, but Hazel is so cute. Hazel's so cute. She's blonde like her mama. The cake is being made. Oh, look at all the dads, they're so happy. And Santa's here. Cause we're, you know, he's our best friend. This is a full house, everything's insane. All right, so who should ace up first? I guess, I guess our first will be Brielle. Blow out those candles, my girl. Everybody's like around her. 
her brother's real stinky. Her dad's like, that's not her dad. That's one of the future dads. So many things are happening. She aged up. Okay, pick a number between one and 41. The answer is 34. 34. She hates children. She's a kleptomaniac foodie that wants a big family and hates children. That's our Brielle! Oh my god! Next is Jamie! Jamie's gonna age up! Oh my goodness, I'm so excited! Jamie, get in here! Oh my goodness, look at him and his little tails and his fancy hair! We love you, Jamie. We, we haven't had you long enough. You, My hot, hot son. He's posing, he's flexing, he's like, what's up, dad? Dad's uh, right here, no, dad's right here. There's dad. He kind of looks a lot like his dad, actually. And then uh, blow out those candles, Jamie. Olive's back and she's gorgeous as usual, celebrating her hot siblings. <laughs> okay. Oh, he's also got responsible, because he's got a responsible trait. Pick a number between one and 41. The answer is one. One, okay, so he's active. That makes sense with our boy. <laughs> Jamie! Ah, he just got celebrated. Okay, your turn, my girl. Add your birthday candles. Too many birthdays all at once, I just can't. Blow out your candles, you angry child. Alexis is mad for some reason. It's fine. Age up, you're a teen now. Oh my god, all of the people celebrating is so fun. Here you go. She's aged up, teenager dumb. Pick a number between one and 12. The answer is six. One, two, three, four, six. She's, she likes food. Pick a number between one and two. The answer is one. She wants to be a master chef. Pick a number between one and 41. The answer is 24. 24, she's also a kleptomaniac. <laughs> she's gorgeous. Do I say that every time I have a new kid, like a kid grow up? Yes, but oh my God, she's a freaking stunner. <gasps> Add those birthday candles, Chelsea. Help blow candles with our baby Charlie here. Charlie's the last to age up of the squad. Come on. I don't care if you need to pee and you're tired. You gotta age up your son. Where's Charlie? Charlie's freaking asleep and he's really hungry. Come on, Charlie. Your dad is here and he's gonna why is Santa in the background just staring at this stuffed toy with a small child in the room alone? No, I don't trust him. All right, now she's going to get Charlie. She really needs to pee, but she looks gorgeous. I need a dress like that, dang. Maybe I should look online for a dress like that. Happy birthday! The baby dad is right there. Okay, here we go. Oh, okay, Charlie's aged up. Pick a number between one and four. The answer is one. Okay, so he's creative. Pick a number between one and 30. It's 14. 14. Vegetarian, another vegetarian kid. Goodness. Charlie and Peter Schmay. Charlie, oh my God, Charlie is so cool looking. Oh my God, Charlie, go give your dad a hug. The birthday has happened. We had all the kids aged up. This is insane. Stan is still creeping in the background with that teddy bear. I don't even want to know what's going on in that situation. We're gonna move out the two kids. I wanna just say a, a sweet goodbye to our beloved teens here, now young adults. Brielle, who looks a little insane. And for Jamie here. You guys have been great teens. I'm excited to get you out of the house because I want twins. <laughs> we can't manage worlds during an event. Oh, so we have to wait for this event to be over. I got a little ahead of myself here. All right, we're gonna end it early. Thank you guys. So we're gonna move out Jamie and Brielle in with their sister. Ah! Back to everyone being in the house and Chelsea's got some business to attend to. So a lot of people are leaving. Gotta at, invite him to stay the night. Yes, Chelsea, get you what you want, girl. Bye, bye. I don't wanna talk to Santa. I just wanna ask him to, what? Did he already leave? No, don't leave, come back. Okay, well, I'll just call him and invite him to hang out then, jeez. Even though he's just here. I know you're tired, my darling. Look at her, when she gets to bed, she wears glasses, it's so cute. She's just like an old Hollywood girl. Chelsea, no, invite him over. We need to make this happen. It was gonna be so much better if he was like at the party and they, ha and they did it, but like they couldn't do it until they were out of the house and the party had to end for them to be out of the house. But just imagine, okay, he stayed over after the party. He's sleeping? Whatever, she's gonna have a piece of cake and take a nap and then when she wakes up, 
the business will be done. Hazel, she's perfect. Our perfect little Hazel, who's really clingy, but we love her anyway. Watch some toddler vids. You gonna eat your cake, Chelsea? What a, a crazy day we've had. I love our new teen. Alexis is a queen. Wow, it feels like all the OG and peachish maze are gone besides like Alexis. It's so crazy. Wow, our first crop of kids are all out of the house, it feels like. Good job, little girl, little Hazel. I love Hazel too. She's super cute with her little funny glasses. It's Winterfest. Wow. Does that mean like Santa's gonna come visit us again? Cause that was weird the first time. Chelsea really needs to cook something else. Fruit salad. That's an option. Eggs and toast is also a vegetarian safe, but this one's a cheaper one, so she's gonna do that. And then after you make that and have a bite, you're gonna invite a special friend over. Homework is complete for Alexis. She's got a unique sense of style there. She's gonna go out on a, a jog in the rain? Uh-oh. I mean, okay. Look at her running in the rain, getting that skill up. I don't think he'll be sleeping now, right? Come on, uh, wasn't... yeah, come on over. Karen? I've never heard that name before. It's so interesting to me. He'll be right over. Yeah. Okay, our boy's here. Invite in. Invite him in. Why is he heartbroken? Why are you brokenhearted? What just happened? Are we having like a bad, are we, did we have something happen during the party that I didn't know about? Why are you so sad? Embrace and then try for baby. Okay, I'm thinking twins might be coming. Come on, come on. All right, baby making time. Let's go. She walked in on her mom doing it with the guy. Oh my God. <laughs> Cannot unsee, it says. Oh my God, that is so funny. Oh my God, that is so funny. Wait, her fitness is still only level one. She needs to find another hobby because my gosh, that's gonna take forever. Oh my gosh. Wait, take that pregnancy test real fast to make sure that we got it done. Chelsea's not pregnant. Ah, uh, no, nah, not again. All right, try for a baby again. She's so embarrassed. I would be too, girl. I couldn't imagine. All right, round two. Here's hoping. <laughs> All her like little baby stuff in the top. It's just so funny. Failed to conceive. Oh, she's sad about it. Oh. Oh, all right, take the pregnancy test. Once more. Is it twins? She seems pumped. <gasps> They're eating for two. Maybe more. You should tell them the big news. By the way, I'm pregnant again. <laughs> I'm still pumped. He's like, oh yeah, girl. Still embarrassed, still trying to forget that she saw her mom woohoo, a strange man, the next baby daddy. Oh, she acquired the cooking skill. That should be her new skill. Easy, we'll just have her read this cooking book. Okay, he said, I should really get going. See you later. And I'm like, bye, fine with us. I'm on top of the world. I've accomplished so much and we're not even done with this episode yet. Whoa, who did that? Parenting, okay, it wasn't him. Who did that? Which kid did it? Was it Miles? Our sweet baby Charlie is cleaning it up. Our perfect baby Angel. I don't know who just made this mess so I can't punish them, but he just learned a valuable lesson and responsibility because he's perfect. She did her extra credit and I didn't even ask her to. <gasps> Alexis! You, Alexis, are one of a, a short line of Impeachishme children that came before you that were amazing. Heroes. Oh, you know what? Wait, who is this adult? Santa's visiting! Uh, I heard the voice of like an adult male and I was like, what is happening? And it's it's Santa. I forgot it was Winterfest today. So yeah, they're just catching up. I don't even know if she had any kids the first time she met him. I think she was kidless at that point. She acquired the potty skill. Good job, my darling. She's like, you started panty training her and didn't invite me, my own child. She's like, yeah, mom, she just farted on the bed. <laughs> and I thought it was really smelly. Mom's like, I'm taking a bath. Charlie's such a cool boy. He looks like a little Justin Bieber vibes here. Maybe he could be like interested in music and something and then become a viral sensation. Ooh, Santa, goodbye, I guess. Okay, Santa's just walk rolling out. Okay, she's gonna give her a bath. Aww. Oh my God, that's the cutest little kid I've ever seen. She's real cute. What, no. We should parent her. Disciplinary some behavior. Ask not to splash in the toilet. Say no. I don't want you to splash in the toilet. Actually, 
Well, how Chelsea put her to bed. I love that interaction. I think it's really cute. Chelsea's not as much hands-on of a mother, you know? Aww. Okay, school starts in about an hour for all of the kids. What a funny little mismatched outfit. She's got little glasses like her sister to go to bed in. Aww, she's tucking her in and giving her a kiss. It's so cute. All right, everybody's off to school. Oh, you don't need to eat that really fast, honey. You should probably go to school. Sorry. Bye, have fun at your first day of high school. I'm sorry that you're sad because I failed you at Winterfest and it's raining, but honestly, you'll be fine. Okay, so now we only have one toddler to focus on right now. Mama's gonna potty train Hazel. She's gonna take a moment. Give her daughter a little bit of attention. It looks like she's a little upset for some reason. So she needs potty trained anyway. Woo, we made $1,100 from books. It's awesome. Love them royalties though. We are almost at $10,000. We could do another home renovation. She's potty level two. That's awesome. Now she can potty on her own. Not much for us to do right now because there's not that many kids. We're just cooking. We're incubating the other kids. <laughs> okay, the kids are done for the day. A B is not bad for Miles. Renee's got to be as well. Uh, Charlie is probably still a C student. Alexis stole, taken after Brielle here. And Alexis is a B student. She could use, there they go. Run, my darlings, run. Take care of yourselves and your needs and prep yourself so you too can get out of the house so I can have more of you. She's also really close to being an A student, which is nuts. That's really good. Wow. What about Miles? Is he close to being an A student? He is. What if we aged them up into teens in this episode too? That would be seven children aged up in one episode. That's insane numbers there, my friends. We're getting crazy here. Chelsea just finished her other screenplay, so she's going to sell to that publisher, and then she's gonna have a celebratory salad, as we all do on occasion. She's a B student, but an excellent B student. We might be able to age her. I would be so sad if she got out of the house that fast. That'd be insane. But at the same time, it's kind of like, well, serve dinner. Let's do garden salad, as usual. This family runs on garden salad. <laughs> I wonder what her like skill level is. Oh, it's there. Oh, I wonder what would be faster, rereading or like making another garden salad. Did you just curse, young lady? Uh, excuse you. How dare you curse firmly, express disappointment for shouting forbidden words. Honestly, I think I raised you better than that. They're having like a heart to heart. She's like, Alexis, I know that you're better than this and we don't shout forbidden words in this family. If she aged up today, that'd be absolutely insane. She's tense because she wants to steal stuff. <laughs> Needs to swipe. Come on, come on, you got this. Why are your manners going down? Are you being rude to your brother again? Does mom have to come back here and yell at you again? Oh, she was so close. Wait, come back, come back. Just reread it one more time. Why is she sad? Oh, she's tired. All right, go to bed. I just left her on that iPad for like all day. That's all she's done today. Reach level three of cooking. All right, now you can do whatever you want. I don't even care. You've done everything that I could ask of you. Can you do extra credit work? Yeah, you can. You're gonna do that next. I'm a drill sergeant of a mother, but if Alexis can move out and we could have triplets, that would be crazy. I don't think I've ever had triplets before in The Sims in my whole life. So that would be fun. I mean, let's not get ahead of ourselves, but that would be awesome. Mom's asleep and growing them babies. Oh my God, Alexis's extra credits complete. Tomorrow's gonna be a big day at school. I'm really curious to see what happens. I'm just like zooming through this because I want all of this to go down. We're on speedy time. Wait, he needs to go to school. Oh no, go to school, go to school, go to school. You're late, I didn't realize it. Hold on, hold on, he's going, he's going. Okay, work really hard, study hard everybody. This could be the day that you all also age up. If, if three more kids age up, that would be eight kids in one episode. <laughs> Charlie's off to school. It's fine, it's fine. We don't need to answer the phone. What happened? Uh, responsibility. What's she up to? She's pottying and I'm watching. I'm uncomfortable because I'm pregnant. Oh, we just gained uh, so much money from royalties and it's New Year's Eve and we hit $10,000. World can't stop us now. Hazel, you spunky, clingy girl with the glasses who gets forgotten all the time, but somehow, like how is she so clingy? She gets forgotten all the time. Oh, uh, Brielle wants to know if I want to meet her someplace. Brielle, it is like 11 a.m. and I'm writing, but we'll all hang out very soon. Okay, she's in like, in 10 minutes, she'll be in her third trimester. She's gonna give birth in, who knows when. Alexis has an A in school. Miles has an A in school. 
and Renee has an A in school, so we can age all three of them up. That's eight children in one episode aged up. Alexis, all as gorgeous as she is, is going to go live with her siblings, so we gotta make a cake. We're gonna have her make a new cake. Oh, she really needs to go, though. Okay, go, go to the bathroom before you make that cake. I don't want you to pee while making a cake. That would totally ruin everybody's birthday. I guess we'll just invite over Alexis's dad, Sergio. Ugh, we hate Sergio, though. He's materialistic and hates children. <sighs> oh well, you're gonna invite him over because it's your new dad. Sergio will be right over, okay. Something broke. Oh, our new shower? Not our new shower. Oh wait, your dad's here. Hang out with your dad a bit, my friend. Lot the candles. She's taking a selfie first. Gotta document the day. Normally we throw a big birthday party, but we have all the important people here. Her dad's in the wrong room, though. Oh, she aged up! Okay, pick a number between one and 41. That would be 17. 17, one, two. 17, she's materialistic, just like her dad. That's great. <laughs> okay, now it's the twins' turn. Twins' turn. Add birthday candles, smiles. Oh wait, he's in the bath. Get out of the bath. You got business to attend to. They're all celebrating his birthday. They're gonna be teens, the twins are teens. Oh my gosh, Miles. Pick a number between one and 12. It's nine. Nine, okay, so three, six, nine. He wants to be a city boy. Pick a number between one and 41. It's six. Six, he's unflirty. Miles is unflirty. <gasps> Look at his crop top. Oh my goodness. Add birthday candles. Our last girl to age up here. Blow out those candles, my girl. Let's see what she ends up looking like. It took her a couple of off times. They're having a fight in the background? What? Was father-daughter fight happening and we just weren't paying attention? Pick a number between one and 12. It's 12. All right, she wants to be popular. Pick a number between one and six. It's four. Four. She wants to be a world famous celebrity. Ooh. This is perfect for Renee because she also wants to be an insider. Pick a number between one and 41. The answer is 40. 40, so she's a bro. She's an insider bro that wants to be a celebrity. All right, I I'm into it. Look at her with her little short hair. Let's say goodbye to Alexis. One last hug. Our baby girl just passed out, but it's fine. Oh, wow, it's thunderstorming here. Oh, they just became best friends. Yay, they're so excited. Oh, hugs. Okay, goodbye. The rest of the world is lucky to have you, Alexis, and your very weird, you know, habits. <laughs> it's gonna go into the other Infusion Shmei household. There you go. What a good looking family. Wait, is that Olive? Olive killing it with the bad fashion statements. I tell you what, eight age ups in one episode. We have room for triplets in the next episode. So give me all your good luck wishes. Let's all in the 100 baby family pray for triplets. I'm feeling great. I hope you're feeling great. Thanks for watching and uh, I'll see you next Saturday. Bye. Feeling awesome. Woo, I've never, I've never, I've never felt so stress-free at the end of an episode of my entire life. Wow, I feel great. I feel very successful today. We didn't have any babies, but oh, man, wow, wow. So much has been done.